Betty. Welcome to another episode of Watch Once Over. Today we're going to be looking at this all new colorway speed timer in red and silver. And this one is really nice. It's the SSC 945 with the caliber V192. It goes for $850 suggested retail price. And this one's available for pickup or to mail out from azfinetime.com. It's in stock now, along with all the other colorways of the speed timers, mechanical and automatic. These ones are super, super cool. Um, they're a big rage. Everybody likes these. They have um, a pretty high precision uh, quartz movement in there in the v uh, V192. But the claim to fame to that movement is that it is solar charging. You do not need a battery ever with this watch. It is in a Seiko Prospects um, X series. It has an unsigned, unscrew down crown, 100 meters water resistance. And then you have a triple sub dial and um, 60 minute elapsed timer counter on here. Now you have a tachymeter scale on that red aluminum insert bezel, which is beautiful. Sapphire crystal with anti reflective coating. And then you have a chronograph, a chronograph that snaps instantly into timing mode. Just push the button and it starts timing. And then the sub dial starts at 60 minutes. When you're finished timing, whatever you're timing, you hit the button again, reset, it goes back. And if you want to go back into battery mode, push it again. And then the bottom sub dial tells you whether you're empty or full and it does have a fuel gauge empty and full now this also includes um, a split timer so if you want to time two events simultaneously you just push the button start the timer and then you push the button again for the first time and then the second time you push the reset First time, the second time, and then the third time, and then you hit reset. So that's pretty cool. You can time two events at once. You also have a running seconds over here at nine o'clock. Look at the beautiful dial on here. Look at that brushing on the dial. Seiko makes some beautiful dials. And these sub dials also double as the collector panels for sunlight. Now you have a date right after the four o'clock, white date wheel with black printing. It is a little recessed in there because this is a quartz watch, but that's okay. All beautifully done up polished case, radio brushing on the top of the lugs, all business brush bracelet with polished sides, twin trigger deployment, fully milled swing arm, and a screw down back. And like I said, this is 100 meters water resistance. And as you can see, it does have a sapphire crystal. And right here, solar. So this one has everything you need, nothing you don't. This is a do it all chronograph. I'll show you the measurements with this real quick. Straight across, it's going to be a 41, the thickness. Is 13.1 the lug to lug with the male ends is 49 without the male ends it's 45.6 then you have a bracelet that tapers from uh, 21 down to just about 18 so this one has those great sacral dimensions you have loom in the form of loomy bright on the indices and the hands, and I'll show you that in a second, but this is what it looks like on my wrist. My wrist is 7.25 inches. Really nice drape on this bracelet, and this colorway is fantastic, and it's different. Now, getting to the loom, you have this beautiful Lumi Bright, and I'll show you what that looks like. That is the Lumi Bright. It is in cyan blue. It's very powerful. This will last all night. 
This form of Lumi Bright is very, very strong. So let me know what you guys think about this one. My name is Beggy. That's the watch once over for today. Please subscribe. God bless. And I'll catch you on the next video.